Hey guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Wanted to do a quick update for Global Aid. Show you where the contract is right now. I think a lot of people are looking at that contract and looking at what the balance is. And then uh, I want to circle back because I missed an important update yesterday on my video on how the other ranks will get unlocked. I was able to get some clarification on that. I wanted to circle back and cover that as well. So uh, anyway, wanted to uh, remind you guys that I am not a financial advisor. Never take anything I say as financial advice. If you are going to get into anything we talk about on our channel, know that there is risk involved in every single platform I talk about. So do your own research, do your own due diligence. And if you're going to get in, only put in what you can afford to lose, guys. Risk capital only. Also, follow me on Telegram. I will leave a link for that down below in the link tree. If you haven't subscribed yet to this channel, go ahead and subscribe. Um, and hit that little bell icon. That way, whenever I post a new video or a review or share a new platform or do a, do an important update, you'll get a notification. Because a lot of times in this space, you know, news and information is uh, time sensitive. So that being said, let's go ahead and jump into it. If you haven't watched my video yesterday, you can go ahead and check it out. I went over all the updates and modifications that they talked about on the Zoom. And uh, yeah, as you guys probably already know, you, uh, you know, withdrawals are not turned on until there's 500 BNB in the contract. OK, um, as I make this video right now, there's 446 BNB, um, close to 90 percent of the liquidity pool stability. Of course, the, the number, the magic number is 500 BNB. And then, um, you know, from from my understanding is they're going to enable withdrawals now. It might fall back below under 500 because people are going to withdraw. Um, people are willing to take that tax because there is a tax once it falls down below five, once it falls below 500 BNB. Um, that'll be the big test, in my opinion. I think once that initial wave of withdrawals, because again, it's been accruing, people's packages have been accruing now for the last, what's it been? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, you know, for the last three days or so. Um, people's packages have been accruing. So that first initial withdrawal, that's going to be the stress test. Okay. If, if it survives that and, you know, I think it can, I think, you know, my personal opinion, I think it will. Okay. Because again, it's not, it's only up to bronze. It's not like people are withdrawing, you know, silver, their, you know, their, their earnings from their silver rank, from their gold rank, from their platinum rank, from their diamond rank, from their blue di diamond. I might've missed one of the ranks there, but you guys know what I'm talking about. They're not withdrawing from those other ranks, okay? They're only withdrawing from the first three ranks, which are the three smallest ranks. Now, that being said, if you have a lot of packages, you know, that could be significant. Like, I looked at what I was going to be able to withdraw just from my first three ranks. Um, it's like 1500 bucks, right? Um, so, you know, it, it all depends on how many packs that you have. But I think, you know, once that initial you know, that initial wave of withdrawal is done, then, you know, if if the contract can stabilize there and then build back up to 500, you know, I think people are going to start jumping into this thing again. Um, and I'm talking about new people, right? Right now, there's, you know, current members that are buying up packs. New members are probably sitting on the sidelines saying, hey, you know, if I buy a pack, you know, will I be able to withdraw? I think once, once it, once it uh, you know, weathers that storm of that first initial wave, and builds back up to 500. Again, I'm just speculating here. It may not build up to 500. I don't know. Who knows, right? But if it builds back up to 500, that's when you're going to see a, the second wave of this thing take off. And obviously, you know, people are going to start buying packages again and, and so forth and so on. Um, but yeah, it looks, you know, it looks like it's building back up. It was at 189 BNB yesterday at the time of the Zoom. So just in that portion of time, you know, it went from 189 BNB to 446 BNB, and it's steadily climbing. So we'll see if it hits 500 today. Maybe it'll hit today. Maybe it'll hit tomorrow. Maybe it'll never hit. I, I I don't know. Just kind of watching this, you know, very fascinated with the behavior of the community and just kind of seeing how this thing works. Like, as I said yesterday, this is a community-based project, just like anything else out there. Anything in this space, it's always going to be community-based, okay? If the community supports it and wants it to to stick around, it'll stick around. If the community doesn't want to support it, then it won't stick around. It's just plain and simple. So it all it all comes down to the, you know, how solid the community is. So we'll see. We'll see how this thing pans out. Um, you can see here if I go to my packs. Um, 
you know, I have 15 pending rewards in each one of these packs. That's what I can withdraw. That's what's unlocked, right? And I have 100 packs, 102, right? But 100 for easy math, that's $1,500. By the time it sits 500 BB, it might be six, you know, 1600 or $1,700. You know, if it goes at the, the, the trajectory it's going right now, at the pace it's going right now, that's probably what I'll be able to withdraw assuming that it stays above 500 now if it falls below i can get a tax you you guys know all about that right um here's what it would look like if i included all the locked rewards uh pretty crazy right <laughs> be like 16400 i'd be able to withdraw but again it's the first 3 that we're able to withdraw and these ranks i'm going to show you here how you can unlock not you but how they would be unlocked um it's going to take a while but you know, at the pace this thing is going, it may not take as long as I thought it would. Um, but you can see here, the beginner, the runner, and the bronze. Those are the only three ranks that are unlocked right now. Unlocked in the sense that you're you're going to be able to claim them once the, the, the contract, if and when, right? If it hits B, 500 B and B, they'll enable the withdrawals. These are locked, okay? So your silver, your gold, your platinum, diamond, blue diamond, right? These are all locked. Now, the way they're going to, unlock these the way they're gonna you know if you want to if you if you want to be able to withdraw from your silver right um, now they're going to continue to accumulate by the way okay but the way they're going to get unlocked is in thousand bnb increments in other words when the contract hits what i don't want to say when like assume it's going to do that if and when right if or when <laughs> however you want to take that if it hits a thousand B and B in the contract, then the silver rank will get unlocked. Then you'll be able to withdraw not only from the first three, but also from the silver. At another thousand, right? If the if the contract hits two thousand B and B, then the gold will get unlocked, right? If the contract hits three thousand B and B, then the platinum will get unlocked. So every rank thereafter gets unlocked. Every time there's a thousand B and B increment that's hit. That's the that's kind of the threshold, the, the the milestone that needs to get hit for these to get unlocked. Now again, they may never gonna get unlocked if it ever if you know who knows if the contract will hit a thousand or two thousand or three thousand BNB. Who knows, right? They may never get unlocked. But on the flip side of that is, you know, it takes away the power from the whales, right? I mean, if you look at you know these contracts, you know it's it's it takes away the um, the ability for whales to just constantly just withdraw all like imagine if i was withdrawing sixteen thousand. Uh, not that i'm a whale or anything i'm pretty sure there's other people that have more in this than i do but if i was to withdraw sixteen thousand, you know every three days sixteen thousand, sixteen thousand, it, it would get you know it'd be hard for it to build up the fact that these are locked right you know it's it's it uh it's a it's a stop there for this contract to get drained right um or at least you know on paper right so you know, we'll we'll see what happens. Okay, I think they put enough measures in this thing to um to make it last. You know, now again, it's all based on the community. Just because they put, you know, some some thresholds that need to get hit to unlock the silver, to unlock the gold, to unlock the platinum, et cetera, et cetera. There's a tax once the contract falls below five hundred BNB. You know, just because they've done all that doesn't mean that this is going to take off. It's again, like I said, it's going to be based on the community. I think they put enough, you know measures in place to you know hopefully have the contract run long term but like i said it's going to be community based does the community want this thing to run will they support it um it depends we'll see we'll see so far you know based on you know what was talked about on the zoom you know there are team leaders out there with teams under them that are that are you know supporting this and uh you know hoping to see this thing run um do i wish this thing you know was going to run for a long time um, again, like I said yesterday in my video, if it never, if I can't withdraw another penny from this thing, um, it was, you know, it was a good run. Like I'm totally satisfied with where we were at with it. Uh, we did pretty well. We got in early enough that we made our initial back multiple times over plus profit. But the flip side of that is, of course, I want this thing to do well. I mean, why wouldn't I want it to do well? It's, it's a, it's an income generating platform that people did well with, right? There's people that never recruited, they they have, they have never recruited anybody in their life, in their in, in any space or any platform that they've been in. They don't even know how to recruit, right? They don't know how to recruit. They never recruited. They suck at recruiting. Uh, they have 
you know, they just, but you know what? They were climbing up those ranks because of the way the power line is structured. It's a very different platform than what we see out there because a lot of times, if you want to earn and move up, you do, even though a lot of these platforms are passive, you do need to build a team, right? With this, you have people coming in the global power line. It's pushing you up and increasing your earnings. So in that sense, it's it's a great, great platform. We saw a lot of people on our team that never recruited anybody in their life and they were moving through the ranks, right? So why would those people not want to support this? I don't know. It's beyond me, right? Um, like I said, I, you know, this is a, to me, it was a, it was a great platform that was just, the math wasn't done right, okay? It was a, Good, good, good meeting people behind the platform. Okay, the fact that they could have ran, in my opinion, they could have ran when the contract was starting to decline. Yeah, we've seen that before, right? We've seen malicious devs, as soon as their contract starts to go down, boom, it's a lock. They lock withdrawals, take that money, put it in another wallet, they disappear. These guys didn't do that. They allow people to withdraw until the contract drained. They didn't even move. Easily, they could have moved the funds. They could have moved the funds to another wallet call it a day and and be gone right um the fact that they're trying to build this and they re, you know redid the contract and they modified it and they're trying to build it back up i think tells you that these guys it wasn't an intentional you know rug right it's just that the contract wasn't you know it, it there was a lot of factors you know there's a lot of factors that they didn't take into account like how fast this thing would grow how viral it would get how fast people would hit blue diamond those blue diamond packs how fast they would start paying out is ridiculous, right? Um, and I, I know a lot of people, you know, I've been in a couple of chat rooms, a lot of people criticizing these guys. And, you know, my question is, you know, what, what would you have done? Like, what, you know, what, what would you have done, right? And I think you can't really criticize these guys unless you've been in their shoes. Now, that being said, I'm not, def I'm not married to any platform. I'm not married to this platform. I'm not defending them. I'm just trying to look at it from, from you know, both sides. I'm look, trying to look at it from an unbiased perspective. Um, at the end of the day, none of our opinions matter. You know, it's, it's, you know, do you want this thing to generate income for you? Then, you know, let's play the game. If you don't, then, <laughs> then don't, it's not a big deal. Um, but yeah, you can see here, this thing is doing its thing. We'll, we'll see, we'll see what happens here to the, to the contract. Um, let me take a quick look here. All right. So 441, what was it before? 446. Right, 448, just, you know, another two BNB went in just as I'm doing this video. So, yeah, we'll we'll see. We'll see how this thing plays out. Uh, like I said, you know, you know, these things were risky. The, you know, when I first did my initial video for this, we said, hey, the risk is 50 bucks. I don't know how long it's going to last. We don't know. And, uh, you know, that three day run that it was that it was on, a lot of people were pulling out, you know, capital from this. You know, they were making some great money with this. So, um you know, I'd love for it to come back and then, you know, get that momentum back. Will it get that momentum back? I don't know. Again, these are all questions that we have no, not, we don't know the answers to. We're kind of seeing this in real time. But, you know, kudos to the to, to the guys behind this platform and to the team and whoever's running those Zooms. You know, they're obviously, uh, you know, rallying, the community's rallying around this thing. And, you know, they're, they're, they're trying to make this thing work. So kudos to those guys. And uh, like I said, we'll see how this pans out. Will it hit 500 BNB today? Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, anyway, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to circle back, talk about some of these ranks and how they would get unlocked moving forward. Give you a little bit of my thoughts on this thing and how it's how I think it's going to pan out. Uh, but again, we'll we'll have to see, um, you know, in real time how this thing works. Anyway, that being said, follow me on Telegram. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that little bell icon so you'll get notified straight away whenever I do a brand new video. And uh, as always, do your own research and risk capital only. All right, guys. Peace.